you a longtime Dickens fan, or what led you into no, this in fact, movie? I'm the opposite. I was largely ignorant about Dickens and his work. And I read this screenplay by Abby Morgan, based on the book Invisible Woman by Claire Tomlin. And it was the, it was the combination of Abby's screenplay and Claire's book that I was surprised. I didn't know the story. I think I'd heard a rumor about Dickens and a young actress, but it was more Nelly. It was a Nelly story that moved me more than Dickens himself. And you must be Miss Ellen Turner. I am. You've met my eldest son, Charlie, of course. He kindly rescued my glove, yes. Ah. How long did you look for the right actress to play Nelly? Not that long. We met uh, quite early on in the process. She very sweetly read for me, and it was amazing. As soon as she left the room, we all went, yes! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Nelly. Nelly, it was a mistake. Did you send Catherine to me? Yes. She is the mother of your children. How could you be so cruel to and her? And for that, I shall always be grateful. Nellie was just such a fantastically strong, unusual human being. And it was, it was her story and, and following her from being with Dickens and, and meeting this incredibly famous, wealthy man and seeing how much strength and power she, she managed to maintain within this huge imbalance in power and in just this, this inner strength that she had attracted me to her. What is it that we are? I think sometimes there's a tendency